Are you sure it was Luke? We brought in seven cars. Six of them were clean. The DNA evidence found in Luke's car was conclusive, and the video footage shows him behind the wheel. Luke's the one who hit Jake. There was no accident. Jake was an amazing kid. I know. I'm sorry. I appreciate you coming by, but you're not just for this here. loss, but because of the way that I've treated you. It was probably hard to let me in after the things that I've said to you. None of that really seems to matter right now. have judged you. He was just being a protective sister because I hurt Lucky. And you didn't set out to and, and people change and things happen and people do things that they regret to the people that they love the most, myself included. And you were a wonderful sister-in-law to me and a friend. And you treated me with more patience than I, than I ever gave you. You don't have to do this right now. I was wrong. I was wrong. And I wish my ego would have let me say that sooner. And that it didn't take the loss of your child. You have to tell Jake. Like any of the other suspects could have hit Jake. Even Carly admitted she was distracted. Yeah, distracted, not drunk. Okay, you do not know that Luke was drunk. Look, Jason, you can get your revenge. You can kill Luke and cover your tracks, but what is that going to solve hurting more people? Think of all the people that you and Luke have in common. Think about Lucky. He raised your son. A life for a life, it does not solve anything. It's not going to bring Jake back. Am I under arrest? No. I was with my dad and he's very angry. He's looking for answers. God, I wish I could have been the one to help him that night. You know, I told them that they couldn't do the transplant. What happened? Because of Lucky. He reminded me of all those other parents praying for a miracle and he said that maybe Jake could be their miracle. You saved Jocelyn's life. And maybe the lives of lots of other kids. I know. I'm hoping that maybe one day that'll help. I think it will. I wish that Lucky could focus on that instead of finding the driver. It wasn't the driver's fault. I didn't lock the door. I didn't hear Jake leave. I was so distracted That's an accident. by all the mail. You want me to get that? Please. found the driver of the car. Do you want me to leave? No. No, please stay. Who was it? Um, well, first you should know that, that it appears to have been a, a complete accident. Given Jake's size and, and the, the darkness, there's virtually no chance the driver saw him. Who hit my son? a mistake. Maybe the lab mixed up samples or something. What? Uh, we took DNA 
from all the cars. It wasn't the car with the forged plates. What is she talking about? We used footage from a traffic camera near your house. I identified seven vehicles that went by at the time of the accident. There was a car with forged plates. Okay. All the vehicles were checked over by forensics and returned. There's no doubt that Luke was the one who hit Jake. And that he was driving the car. Oh, God. No. My dad had no idea. We talked about him being on the road that night. Not for a second did he think that he would have done something like this. Do you mind telling me? He didn't know. I, 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 can, can you please both just leave? Okay. I know that you would want me to go. And I'll go. I just think that maybe Dante should stay with you. I would rather be alone right now. If you could just go. Please. No, not since last night. What this happened? is so much worse than you know. What happened? What happened? My dad's the one who hit Jake. No, no, that's not possible. Forensics proves it. He knew he was one of the seven cars that they were checking out, but he didn't give it a second thought. What did Lucky say? I don't know. Lucky's... Dante said that Lucky's going to tell him. Because he thought it was Carly. Oh, my God. I wish I had him. He was ready to go after her and believe the worst. I can't believe it was Luke. How are they going to make peace with this? <sighs> Luke's life won't be right without Lucky in it. The guilt has to be eating him alive. The fear that he's going to lose his son forever. 